Hey everybody, it's Friday. I'm not going to work today. I took the day off because yesterday was my birthday. I had a little bit of fun last night. Check out that video here. It was good. It was good. But today, I am leaving Astoria to go camping. Here's my stuff. My bag. One sleeping bag. I've got another over there because Katie Mack has joined me. We're actually going camping out in Brooklyn. I know that sounds weird, but it's going to be fun. My only concern is that it's been raining for the last two days, and it's supposed to rain all weekend. Hopefully it doesn't rain too much. Uh, I don't mind a little bit of rain. And I have uh, rain boots, so we should still be good. I'm just looking forward to a relaxing weekend in the woods. All right, let's go. All right, so the campground I'm going to is next to Floyd Bennett Field. It's a thing called Gateway Park, Gateway Campground. To get here, to get there, you have to take the 5 train all the way to the end of this Brooklyn College Flatwood from Bush Avenue. And then, you take the Q35 bus. Before I catch the bus, I'm going to get some last minute food supplies. Alright, I have a bunch of extra supplies. Because I have so much stuff, it's windy, sorry. Um, I decided to take an Uber instead of taking the bus. Still not that far away though. Uh, it is, as you can hear, super windy out right now. I'm here, sort of, but I don't know where to go. I hope this wasn't a bad idea. We'll see. Alright, I'm finally here. I took one train to potentially one bus. Took an Uber instead, but and then a little bit of a walk. But let me show you around the campgrounds a little bit. I'm convinced that we're gonna be the only ones here, which is really cool. It's a upside to the weather. So this is our campsite, G28, fire pit, and a little um, grill. But there are three campsites, I think, in this little area, but again, no one's here. Picnic table, oh, I can set up a tarp in the trees. Once Katie gets here, uh, and most of the day tomorrow, we're gonna do a little bit of exploring around the area. There's Lots of activities to do around here. I'm just looking forward to relaxing. This is like my birthday weekend and I just want to relax. So let's, uh, I'm gonna get the, the tent set up, I think. And we're all done. Not too bad. This is only the second time that I've used this tent. The last time was in Montreal on my big road trip last year in July. Uh, that was a fun time, but it rained then as well. And then the time before that that I went camping, it rained. So hoping that the rain's gonna hold out tonight. It just makes things easier, you know? I decided to put up this rain tarp so that if it does rain, cross fingers that it doesn't, but if it does, we have a little bit of cover over the picnic table. Right, I need to fill up my water bottle and uh, go to use the restroom, so let's take a wander around. These campsites are all right, but I like the seclusion that we have. There are the bathrooms. That's good to know. Well, that makes me want to go in there. Maybe tomorrow. As I've been wandering, I've noticed about five or six of these giant spider webs. I don't know if you can see it right there. Maybe they're not spider webs. Maybe they're silkworm pods. Here you go. Look at that. That's crazy. I have found what I'm looking for, water. I am quite parched, so this is great. Hey, and it works. It is extremely windy, but it's beautiful. So, obviously, Kenny Max here. You give 
Damn, sweet <laughs> We're laying out all our food to see what we got, and she surprised me with this amazing cheese. I don't know what kind it is, but... Oh yeah, no, hold on, I know the name. A drum cheese. Drum cheese. D-R-U-M-M. Bobo Link Dairy. On Bakehouse. But it's so stinky, and it's great. I got it because it was the stankiest. Cheese. Cheers, cheese. Well, we're trying to start a fire now, and I have these fire starters, and they just, they won't light. And it's, I don't know if it's because the air is so moist, but none of the paper will light either. It's going well so far. <laughs> Let me demonstrate. Looks good, right? Looking good. Again, again. Ooh, this one might be it. Oh my god. You guys. Ah! <laughs> I think we might have gotten it. It's still lit. Fire! <laughs> That's fire! So... So we have some food made already. We got some bacon, um, some bread, some hot dogs. It's way too much food. But we are eating like kings today. King. It's good. And we're making some more bacon. Making bacon. Let's see, hold on. I think this might be the wow that is really burnt. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. Some gins. Oh. Mm. Mm. oh my god. That looks good. Yeah. Katie made a baked apple. Of course I made a baked apple. It looks good. It'd be good with that cheese. There are some raccoons in the trees. See them? Dude. Hey. See him there? We, well, Katie mostly has gone on a, like, <laughs> campfire baking spree. We took these cookies here, and she put them in tin foil. And then the fire, look at that. Oh my god. Magical. It's like caramely, fiery, <laughs> creamy. Just like you, <laughs> all those things. <laughs> so I describe myself. <laughs> and we're in the tent, calling it a night. Pretty soon. Katie's gotta check her email first. Can't leave civilization completely. I did a good job. No, I'm not saying you. I mean, just in general, people. I know you can. Yeah. But we had a good night, had lots of food. We feasted like kings. We were queens. kings. It was really great. Um, so we're gonna go to bed and we'll see you tomorrow morning. Say goodnight to the raccoons. Raccoons? They're around here somewhere. Thanks for watching, we appreciate it. Uh, see you in the next one, bye.